Hey there, everyone, this is SoCal playing what's maybe, probably, the finale of Tales Adventure. Before I do anything, I thought of something. So, like, there's probably one equ a power-up, an equipment left. Like, that leftover square, like, right here, like, called The Wrench, apparently. That is still to be missing, and co oh, look at that, that's a house with an arrow, that's cute. Like... It's, it, it's an object that is missing and again that I need to collect, it's probably gonna be in there. Now if you remember the start of the game, whenever at the start, whenever I got a power up, it got added to my menu, right? So if I come with my- oh it won't let me empty it? Oh man, I thought I was being smart. Well, never mind then, I guess I'll put on Sonic the Super Mart and uh, we're gonna go and uh... Because, like, it's kind of silly, right? Because, like, anyways, so we're gonna go, it's Battle Fortress, the second door, and let's just, it's, it's final level. If I got Sonic, I'm here to stay. I can do all that every day. Look at that, I can spin dash <laughs> when there's carpentry. Whoa, robot formation! The birds have been at mechanic all this time. Hi, buddy. I mean, I can't go there. Cause yeah, you can use Sonic to just burst through walls like that, and it's just a lot more efficient use of everyone's resources. I don't know if you can do it. Okay, here it doesn't look like it. I've, I've, I got all my regular tools too that you can never leave behind. See, now the vibe that I get is that like, oh shoot, oh, I'm so good, is that like, there's gonna be a shenanigan where you get that last tool and then you can't do anything or something. Like, because like, you cannot have an object as soon as you got it. It's up there. Okay. Okay. Is there an easy way to get up there? Well, that's what we're figuring out together. What's that? I don't know, man. It's a box. Don't think about it. Look at that. Normally you have to fly- oh, okay. There's an electric barrier. Gotta find a switch somewhere. Gotta find a switch somewhere, buddy. Is it down here? In this hell pit? I got myself a little robot, buddy. I've been using all game to do a whole bunch of nonsense. You can go on the spike all day long. I feel like at one point, this guy wasn't invincible. But at some point, he became invincible. There's just no other rhyme or reason. It's just happened. Everything is so nice and golden. Alright, you can do it, little buddy. Hooray, we did it. Oh, yeah. Just, I'm just gonna go and check things out here. Wow, it is extremely uninteresting. <laughs> we did it, guys. Uh, we've solved continental continuity. Finally. Together at last. No, oh, there's something up there, but we're just not there yet. Alright, look at that. I'm gonna go up here, then yeah, Sonic the Hedgehog. Smells like hot dogs. Yeah, he doesn't. He's not proud of that part, but you know it's just a reality, man. If you spend your days eating chili between bread, so is that what a chili dog is? Like, is that a real thing, or was that made up for the lore? Like, I've always kind of wondered about that. So I think there's a passage up there, but I think like this is where you need to go if you're interested in getting an extra power up that you can't use. Okay, so that I can do. Like, I just need to jump, land here like an idiot. There we go! It's right on the other side of that. Okay, oh, I can go up here. Um, alright, so we got a new area zone. Man, I don't know how you get in there. Is there like a way below from here? Like, it doesn't look like it. Alright, well, uh, maybe we'll find, like, another door that leads us there in some way or something. That could be exciting. So there I can't help but notice that there's a barrier, but yeah, we're gonna have to send a little robot through the ceiling. Alright, I can do that. Like, I don't know if I need to, but, I mean, it's, it's an option given to me by the video game. Let's do it! Check it out! We can see that little... A little kneeling, kneeling guy, he's just kind of hitching a ride. I'm like, yeah, you did it, buddy. So now, thanks to that, I can now eat red corn. But first we gotta wait for my droid to transliterate to where I'm at. That's my favorite part of breakfast. Can I, can I go here? 
Okay, no, that's just the end of the screen. Nothing to be concerned about. You fool! Alright, check that out. We're on conveyor belts. Isn't that grand? Did you ever not want to go in a conveyor belt? Get out of here. And I'm gonna destroy these walls, too. Whoops! And I was supposed to... Oh, what's over here, then? Like, you know, let's at least take a little look. I'm a little curious. Uh, Alright, so... I like to spin Nash, but I need to be careful because very often... Yeah, like, I kind of veer out of control and I end up in, like, things that make me fall, so I have to... Uh, be considerate about where I decide to just kind of ball up willy-nilly. Like, it's not a good idea to just always do. No, no, no. Yeah. There we go. Then I can just land here. Here we go. Alright, see here, you gotta be careful. Uh, you gotta fly. You got spikes. You gotta land places. Whoa, that guy's got a gun. If he shoots you, you're gonna fall, you know? It's the only reason to fear firearms. I got so much air gauge, though. Like, I can just fuel it up forever, man. Not impress. Get wall napped. On the casual. Well, I need to find a button somewhere for that wall. Is it up here? Oh, game is... Oh, there's another... Okay, then. Well, that's not what I wanted to happen. So, oh, you're just not, okay, well, okay, so I'm missing, like, there's, okay, so I'm missing, like, a pair of buttons somewhere. I feel like I've explored a lot, but there must be a nuance I'm missing somewhere. Yeah, there's nothing here. Um, I'm starting to be a little concerned. Well, okay, I haven't explored, like, every inch, though. And probably one of the laser places is gonna lead to, like, another laser place. So yeah, don't be too concerned yet. Like, here I didn't explore, like, super fully. Like, I didn't check out over here, for example. Like, underneath here, maybe? No, yeah, no, I have. It just leads behind him. Uh, huh. So yeah, up here, there's not really anything. Okay. Yeah, I have opened that up. Yeah, here. Uh, it's here. Okay, so it has that. That just leads back here. Oh, but I can maybe send a robot in there? This is a complicated area. Okay, so those are rings are there to hurt my little robot, buddy. Yeah, like, they deactivate them, and they just shuffle on back the tail. Is this possible? Um... Like, cause I just don't see what else to do. Like, okay, 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 okay. So there's a way to fly just barely above the conveyor belt. There we go. Awkward. Yeah. No, there's... Yeah, but it works. Alright, and we press the button of some kind. Uh, some kind of button has been a knowledge today. Finally. So I don't know where that opened up a thing, but it opened up a thing. Alright, let's look around. So, yeah, I can go down there now. Alright, that's why I'm also bringing bombs. Situations like this. Alright, the open air of Nebraska. Finally, just gonna trip on those spikes very clumsily. And that guy got hurt. Poor him. Okay, this is just a weird, like, robot dumping ground. Okay, another place for a little bot boy buddy then. Got it. I don't know what we're doing here, but we're doing it. Lots of robot. There we go. You did it. You got a little helicopter ride noodle. Like, there's a bunch of enemies that cannot interact with you here, so that's cool. Yeah, you can only fly if you're on the ground with this man. Alright, so there's the sky. That's background. Very, very, very... Like, I feel like maybe that's where things continue. Yeah, that's where I need to go. Uh, is there a switch over yonder here? There's 
a big wall. It's like a switch. That's okay. No. Oh. oh, what? No, I don't know how this works at all in the slightest. All right then. Um. Yeah, I need a switch for you. I don't know where to find that yet. Doesn't seem to be here. So why can I sand my robot here? Was it accidental? I mean, maybe. Because yeah, there's just nothing to be getting. Oh, it's here. <laughs> it was very well hidden. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Sometimes that happens and there's nothing you can do about it. But that confirms my path to go. Now we should be able to continue in this direction here. Hey, buddy, you hurt me with your shiny green head. Congratulations. No, wait, no, I need to, like, get up there, right? Unless I'm misunderstanding. Because, like, I was, like, right near it. Dude! Uh, well, like, I understand now how flight control works, but they are still, like, weirdly lagged. Yeah, it's over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. We can go to the upper echelon of the World Resort. Hey, it's that guy. Okay, that hurt. I heard that ding. All right, where are you hiding out? Oh, there you are. Whoa, you got a little, like, uh, Hadouken. Well, I got turned into a circle. You throw circle, I become circle. Like, I think we both know here who carries the true power. So yeah, this is my chosen methodology of fighting there. This is just kind of stay in the bottom. You wait for him to... Oh, he's got the big fire now. Big fire crescent. Well, I got nudging into you softly, so... I think we know who has the winning hand here. Boss bird. Yeah, that's right. You're getting hurt somehow. I mean, I too, but you get hurt more, so... Whoop, not there, though. Yeah, that's right! You're blowing up now! Isn't that inconvenient? You are dust! You have literally just kind of evaporated. That's honestly a little uncomfortable. But hey, now I can... S oh, jeez. Uh, look at that guy in his goofy pants. Alright, that hurt him. Then, oh man, he's got the choke move. All right. Okay, so I cannot do that. Got it. We're changing to triple bomb. But I get it now. Don't touch. He has bomb too. It's a bombing fight. A bomb battle. There we go. Brute force against smarts, but using bombs as a media of our discussion. Oh no, he's doing that squat and bomb move. <laughs> oh jeez, uh, oh jeez, now, now I'm not hearing anything, so I don't know if I should be worried. Look man, I can just fly above you and rain death upon you willy-nilly as a fox is wont to do. Uh, oh jeez. I don't mind that, except that it takes forever. <laughs> don't- no, that is not what I wanted to do at all, in the slightest. I just want to fly, man. Let me fly. That's all I want. My only desire. Just let me- oh, jeez, I'm bad. Yep. Oh, he's on his- he's on his butt! He's on his back! I'm still gonna throw bombs at him! Alright, look at that. Oh, it's moving on its own. Tail just sliding along to his cyber sled. And, uh... Wait, did I win? But what about that last box? The wrench! Or is this not... I don't know, man. That island is just dissipated. It's just gone. It's just vanished. Meanwhile, Tails is building Mechasonic, apparently. All this time, it was Tails' creation. <laughs> right next to his dollhouse and swing set. <laughs> and Flicky's there going, Yeah, we've regressed to a lower life form because of you. And Tails like, Quiet bird! Oh, wait a second. I hope that's not a mecha for Flicky. Did he create Omega all the time? Look at that! Flicky's just messing up with his machine. What a jerk. What a bunch of pixels for a face. 
<laughs> All right, well, the wrench forever shall be a mystery. Uh, I'm sure that the the book the booklet is gonna tell us what it's all about. What is he building, Robotnik? That's kind of starting to look what it is, man. Oh, oh, okay, he's just making a big version of the, of, of the little boy. Okay. Interesting how we installed the head while working on pieces and like behind though. Like that is some astute engineering. I'm liking this little like scene though. It's just you know, tell lies. Life continues. He just massacred this uh, invading civilization. I was just day as usual. Let's go. Vague hand motions, but you know they tell a lot. They they tell exactly what you need to know. This game was cute. This game was honestly pretty good. Like I I was pleasantly surprised. Uh, just how well made it is. Really, it's a pretty nice like sort of exploration game. I don't know if it's quite a metroidvania, to me it's more, like it's relatively linear. I don't know. I, I, I feel it's more like just like, it's a, it's an action game, but you know, puzzle action game, but you got, you got some branches. I guess that might be enough for a metroidvania, I'm not sure. Well that just happened. I wasn't looking at the screen, now the head is gone. I'm gonna see what happened in the recording. Oh well, the head is back. It's as simple as that. Inflatable head! Uh, so coming up next, we are sticking to the Game Gear. We're, we're just never leaving Game Gear. But we're gonna be playing Sonic again. Uh, and the game was featured in Fuso Grande, so... I'm sure it's gonna be a blast. <laughs> Look at that! Bert, is he dan- I think he's dancing. He's trying to... Oh, well, then it blew up. It's, it's a little- it's a little piece of comedy. It's now tells all gray- he's, he's Gray Fox! He's gonna learn how to use a sword and telecom. Yeah, 97%. I'm okay with that. 97 is pretty damn good, Crunchy Sega. And you know it. 